All right, Southwind, welcome back to another episode of Excellence Wins. Today, we're gonna to be talking about two of the four supreme objectives. Number one is keep your customer. Number two is get new customers. Let's start with number two. You know, when you're running a business, typically 10% of the money made goes towards marketing to get new customers. For example, if your business did a million dollars in revenue on the year, you're gonna spend $100,000 to get new customers. What does that include? That includes what you hear on the radio for advertising, billboards, TV commercials, you name it. 10% of what you earn actually goes back to getting new customers. So it's really important that we really hit home on point number one, which is to keep the customer. All right, and the first of the four supreme objectives is to keep the customer. The best way we can measure whether we're doing this or not is to look at these KPIs. First, your Google review return ratio. We should be working to exceed customer expectations so much so that they leave us a Google review, which would definitely solidify we're on pace to keep the customer. The next KPI would be your NPS or your net promoter score. This is an internal survey that we see only. No one else outside of our organization can see this score, so you know you're going to get real raw data from your customers. The third KPI that would indicate whether we're keeping our customers or not is your complaint percentage. At Southwind, we have a goal that our complaint percentage is at 1.5% or less. I would like to highlight the Omaha franchise for January doing an excellent job of keeping the customer. Their Google review return ratio was 101%. Their NPS was 95%, and their complaint percentage was 0.9%. Omaha, way to be excellent. So remember, there are four supreme objectives, and the first two, number one, keep the customer. Number two, get new customers. Next week, Aaron Hosack will be taking you through step three and step four. Remember, excellence wins.